so today I am meeting Lena again. So we're just gonna do some catching up. So I am very excited. It's a bit early, but I think I'm gonna be leaving a little early too because I'm taking the bus and you don't know how traffic can get. I like taking the bus a lot more than taking the subway. So yeah, also my fit for today. It's very comfy because I cannot be asked. Also, I slept at like 5 a.m. I woke up at like 1.20. <laughs> Apparently, Lena's gonna be running late. So I'm gonna go straight to her hotel. <laughs> I feel extremely underdressed. <laughs> Off, but I'm sure once like I take this bag outside, she's gonna like dry up real quick. <laughs> it's hot as hell. It's Lena again. Oh my god, yeah, it's been so long. It's been like three videos. <gasps> Can we see? That is a vibe. I mean, I feel like it's kind of against dark, the light. Yeah. But like, this is deep. I uh, wait. Tell what me what. What do you mean it's deep? <laughs> like, I didn't. Mean Hello everybody, I am with Lena again and I am finally at her hotel. Yes. And this is actually the first time I went inside a hotel in Seoul. Oh spicy! Like, you're right. <laughs> you're giving me an experience here. Yeah, this is like nice. It's quite it's nice. It's really yeah. nice. Yeah, the views are amazing. So we're gonna go to Style Nanda Pink Hotel. And it's a very popular destination for tourists, <laughs> though I've never been there I know. personally. I know. Myeongdong area, this is like the popular place, but she's like dead, so it's like no absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Actually though, no actually! <laughs> it's been so long since mm -hmm. I've been to Myeongdong wow. And like the last time I was here, someone hit on me <gasps> Yeah, so I was, after that I never really went back <laughs> No, she was gone! <laughs> but like now, mm -hmm. I'm back mm -hmm. And we're going to make better memories Yes, yes. And after Style Nana, we're going to go eat some Vietnamese food yes. Oh my yeah. god, I've been craving pho and banh mi. I want pho. And, and yeah. I love having friends that can eat. You don't understand. <laughs> I this can, eat. can eat. This I can, can eat. eat. Yeah, y'all know that. You too. have to. You're a college student. You have to eat. <laughs> <laughs> you have to. Anyway, that's that. So see you guys at the cafe. See ya. It's been so long since I've been here. Oh my god, you can see Namsan! Yeah! Oh, I did not see that all this time. <laughs> okay, I've been in Korea for so long, every time I see Namsan, I'm like, oh my god, Namsan! It's like in Paris, every time I saw the iPhone, it's I'm like, like, oh my god! And then my, my Parisian friends are like, Lena, chill out. <laughs> this whole building is empty. That's and so sad. And the one behind you. Time to head to the cafe and refresh ourselves. We came here like 4.45, 4.50 and then we noticed that the cafe break time ended at 5. So perfect timing. We've arrived at the cafe. Sadly though, the upstairs where we wanted to go to, it's closed today. Out of all the days. Also, I find it so weird because like we talk to the staff in English. I know, it's weird. It's really weird. I can't believe the upstairs closed. <laughs> 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 
for the sake of Instagram. But I, I'm so close to here. Yeah, you can literally yeah. go tomorrow. It's like, when will I be able to go? It's gonna be like years. It's gonna be years. Really, Myeongdong. Honestly, yeah. like once you like, obviously as a tourist, you would like Myeongdong is one of the first destinations you would go to. And then you never go again. Yeah, but once you live here, you just like never go. <laughs> Oh my god, this is such a cute Wow. That'd be nice. Oh, you got a yes. green tea latte. What's your favorite dish? Pho. Mm. I'm, I'm like the most American Vietnamese girl. <laughs> I like pho and then me. left the cafe and right now we're walking back because we're gonna get some Vietnamese food yes. also the Sun is going down so it it's actually great. very pleasant anyway catch you later See ya. It's my first time eating Vietnamese food with a Vietnamese person oh my gosh I'm so honored <laughs> We ordered beef pho. Yes, pho. And pho mi. Pho mi, yeah. Did you ever stop and think why spend too much time just getting ready? Look at Lena just struggling. Yeah. Can you even see this angle? I don't want a single thing that I haven't done to make you notice me. Let me be real here. When I see you, my heart starts racing. But I don't know if I like this chasing. Let's go home, Shane. Let's go home. Let's go home. <laughs> I'm gonna go back to Lena's hotel for a bit and then go home. So I think I'm gonna end this day here. Yes. Bye bye. See you guys when I come back. <laughs> That's an interesting looking grill. Yeah, I've never cool. seen that before. Oh no, the fire looks so much better. <gasps> this is your cake. This looks amazing. I know. We need candles. Happy one year anniversary. I don't know what I could say to convince you to hang around. When you don't have There's so much that Starts racing, but I don't know if I like this chasing and playing and waiting around. It's a shame that my hands start shaking all of the time when you're around me. But Harder. this time, this time, girl, I know what's bothering me. I need somebody to love. Oh. So Right now, Juon is here. We're taking photos because it is my one year of YouTube celebration. They also bought me a little bamboo plant. You guys should help name it. Yeah, so just names for my little bamboo plant. We also bought some cake and some balloons. I'm so excited to take photos. Thank you so much again for all of the support up until now. And I hope you continue to support me. You hold my hand, look me in the eyes You and me, yeah that's all
Good morning, everybody. I started my day out with um, chores. It's around 10 something right now, and I am craving Isaac toast. If you guys know about it, it's kind of like a brunch, no, not brunch, branch toast place here in Korea. But before that, I do want some coffee, so I probably will make my coffee so that I can have it with my toast. Anyway, let's go. Coffee's done, laundry's hung. Let's go get some Isaac toast. Hello, Ramona. I can't shake the simplest feeling. Okay, literally, what is this timing? The day I decide to crave Isaac's toast, which just happens to be on a Saturday, happens to be their day off. Alright, anyway, I think I'm just gonna take this as a sign to cook. I think I shall make some rice noodles. Oh, but my coffee would be would have been perfect with toast. Alright, whatever. Let's make some rice noodles instead. We stand on the opposite shore. Hello, Ramona. I reach through mysterious ceilings. My only hope I look for the things I don't know For all in this I stand alone Show me where the end Show me where the ending goes Honest, honestly don't I should be the last and... The food is ready Oh my god, I'm so hungry mm, That's good I feel like during the semester This is one of the dishes that I'd be making the most Just cause the ingredients are really easy And it doesn't really take much time to prep Oh my god Why do I always drop food? Do you guys have one of those days where you just kind of feel uglier than usual? For me, that's what today is one of those days. So I'm actually quite surprised that I was able to like get up and turn the camera on. I guess everybody has those days, you know. And basically, we just kind of live with it. Anyway, I'm just going to be finishing my food and I don't know what I'm going to be vlogging today. But yeah, see you guys whenever. Hi, I don't know if you noticed, but I moved my shelf beside my bed. <laughs> okay, basically, I am editing on my bed right now, but I ordered some groceries this morning from Kupang and they have arrived. So um, they're just frozen fruits because I wanted to make smoothies here at home. Let's pick it up. <laughs> Frozen avocado, frozen blueberries, and frozen mango. Hello, so I have been editing the entire day. I'm sorry I wasn't really able to film, but I just ate dinner. Didn't really film that one because I had a bus and meal. It's just that it kind of looked but it's okay, we're learning. Anyway, right now, I'm about to make a smoothie and what I'm planning to make is blueberry banana smoothie. I went to the grocery earlier to get like, you know, the banana and I was just looking for like nice bananas. I wasn't really looking at the tags, but look what it says. So I guess my subconscious just knew which banana is like from the Philippines, you know? Although I do prefer like um, Latundan banana, this would work too. They're like, they only have these types of- <laughs> Oh my god, why do I drop food so much? Oh my god, 
Why do I always drop food? They only have these types of bananas here in Korea for some reason. We got our frozen blueberries. Do you guys pour your milk like this or like this? Okay, so I'ma just blend this and I'll update you on how it turns out. Ta-da! This is what it looks like. I tasted it. It was bussin'. Um, I'm very happy with this. That's good. I feel like because the banana is like really big and sweet, it wouldn't hurt to add more blueberries next time. Maybe next time I could add like yogurt or something like that but anyway if you guys have any smoothie recipe recommendations feel free to leave it down below hi so i'm done with my smoothie and I, my entire mouth actually turned blue like i had to brush my teeth twice anyway i wanted to talk to you guys about something so like this is the last segment of this vlog like this um home thing because covid is taking over seoul right now and i know you guys want to see more of like the streets of seoul and stuff like that but the reality is it is kind of dangerous to go out right now especially because i'm still not vaccinated Vaccinated because vaccination rollout here is really slow. I hope that even though I don't get the chance to go out as much compared to before for health purposes, you know, like at least these type of domestic home vlogs, you would find some entertainment in them. Of course, like every chance I get to go outside, I will try to vlog because it's not illegal to go outside, but I guess like more than illegal, it is irresponsible to be like dining outside and everything like that. So yeah, I hope you guys understand and if you guys want any type of content that I can do at home, feel free to tell me as well. Once again, thank you so much for all of the support and I think I'm going to be ending the vlog here. So I will see you guys in the next one.